Hey everyone, welcome back to another video. If you're new, welcome to our channel. Today I'm going to give you guys a basic review of Dynascape, the design and color softwares. So I'll go ahead and give you a review of what the softwares are and then tell you guys if it's even worth it for your company. Alright everyone, let's go ahead and get into the design software of Dynascape. So I'm basically, I'll be showing you some of the projects that we have created. We did take a Dynascape course here at our college, so that's what these are all from. Um, I'm not going to be showing how to use Dynascape if you are interested. Um, leave a comment down below and we can always make a series or a video of how to use Dynascape, but in this video I'm just going to be doing a quick review of it and letting you guys know if it's worth it. So here is one of the projects we did. I'll go ahead and zoom into it and show you guys um, what's all in it. So as you can tell it's very detailed. It is a CAD software. so. It literally gets down to less than an inch. Um, here you can tell these are different layers. Those are found over here. Um, it's really nice to have those layers because um, when you click on the layers, I'm not going to do it, but you can literally see only the trees or only the buildings, only whatever layer you wanted to see. Um, it's really convenient especially if you wanted to print it off if you do have different employees doing certain things. Um, you do have to hold down on the shift key so it thinks that I have sticky keys. But um, yeah, this is basically this little project. I'll go ahead and zoom out for you guys. You can see it's really nice. Um, but what I'll do here is this little layout, but over here, we did go ahead and put in all of the plant names and everything. That's really one awesome thing about Dynascape is over here it has the pictures of the plants that you used um, as you can see right here. It also does give you the option to have the plant shown in common name or scientific name. Um, it's great to have the scientific name for the professionals of the industry but also the common names because most clients don't know um, the plant scientific names. Um, so whenever you do go in here and put in these titles, it does give you the option to automatically have it linked to this certain plant, which I'll show you guys the plant catalog that Dynascape will create along with it. So there is that. Um, over here also, you can create your own title blocks. This was just a fun little thing. Um, we created this um, arrow over here and I'll also show you guys some really cool things that you can also create with Dynascape that aren't design related. So here's another one. As you can see, it also does have the plant key over here. That makes it really nice if you do want to have it on the design already. Um, and then again, the other different types of title blocks are really cool. It gives you a lot of figures over here, which I'll show you. Um, yeah, there's just so many. And honestly, it takes so long to learn all of this because there are so many different things. It's really awesome um, to play around with and see what it does have. So that's just an, a little simple um, landscape. We do have some others over here, as you can see. It can get very complex or be very simple. That's a really good thing about Dynascape. Um, then over here, as you can see, that was one of our very first projects. So it's very simple. Um, it's really, it's really neat and also has the little scale over here. But one thing I did want to show you guys with the Dynascape is over here, we created um, a little cover photo for our portfolio with Dynascape. So that was really awesome. Um, to use. So, yep, there's the imaging, here's all of your editing tools, uh, 
very, really um, complex software, but it literally has everything that you will need. So I'm going to go ahead, jump over to the PDFs um, that it does create. So here is the plant catalog that it will come up with. Um, this is one of the designs that I showed you guys. It's really awesome um, to really give, to show the client what the design has. So here, I'm just going to go through this, let you guys see those plants. These are plants that are in the software already. You can change the image based on what you want, but that's really awesome about Dynascape. It has it in there, so you don't have to worry about it. It also gives you the um, option on here again to have it the common or scientific name. Um, with this one, it does have both of those listed here. And then you can change the title up here. Um, but here, this is the PDF that, that um, the design software will create. Here is the black and white view, basically. Um, and then again, there is the title. Um, or the plant key and then your tile block over here so let's go ahead jump into the color design software here it is um, here's another cover page we did create really awesome um, uh, instead of just using landscape designs but I'm gonna go ahead open up some of our saved presentations um, here this one is one that I showed you already. So we'll wait for that to load. Here it is. We did this. Um, it does take a little, um, pretty lengthy depending on how well you want it. But the really awesome thing is about Dynascape is it does already have those symbols. So if you click on it, um, I can't show you guys right now, but it will automatically fill it in. Um, and you can choose all these different styles, colors, um, based on the plant that it is. So that is really awesome. This one I really love because it really goes into detail and can really show the idea of the design. So we'll scroll up a little bit over here. Um, it does also have these different styles and um, colors for the um, the patterns of like the pavement, the stones, everything like that, mulch, grass, it's all there. It's really awesome. So I'll go ahead, jump back over here and show you guys the PDF that I will create um, when that's finished. So there's that. That's that one. Really awesome. Really goes into really good detail of the project. Sorry about that, guys. Um, but yeah. There it is. Really awesome. Um, so let's go ahead. I'll give you guys my thoughts of it overall and tell you guys if it's even worth it. All right, guys. So let's go ahead and get into my review, my rating of this software, um, specifically the design and color software that I showed you. It is super awesome to work with. It is super fun and really does go into detail of everything that you might possibly need for the job. So it all depends on what fits for your company, if you're a smaller company, a larger one, or just a homeowner. So let's go ahead. I want to talk to you guys about the pricing. So these softwares do run two to $3,000 based on the bundle. Um, that will be for the initial cost, um, the download of the software. And then it does come with a basically a monthly fee, a subscription, which are, I think, under $100. So for this specific bundle with the design and color, it will run you about $2,500 and then with a $50 monthly fee. So it all depends on what how many jobs you're working with. For our company, this wouldn't be ideal just because we don't do that many designs. So a more cheaper version of a software, which we did make a video with what we use. We'll put that up here so you can go watch that if you'd like. But yeah, overall, I think this is a really amazing software. If we in the future did have more designs, 
I would totally consider this software. Um, but again, I just showed you guys the basic review of it. Um, if you are interested, we can do a video um, about how to use it if you guys would like to see it more in depth. So thank you so much for watching this video. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed it and learned something about Dynascape. It's a really wonderful um, software, as I mentioned. We worked with it for a whole school semester and got to learn it inside and out. So thank you guys so much for watching and we will catch you guys in the next one.